So today I'm talking about a P0106 code, what it is and how you go about fixing it. And so what is a P0106 code? Well, it's a manifold absolute barometric pressure sensor range performance. And what does this mean? Well, the vehicle's computer needs to know how much air is going into the engine so that the computer can adjust the air fuel ratio mixture that's going into the cylinders. And so to measure this airflow, there could be different sensors that's located on the engine. There could be a manifold absolute pressure sensor and a barometric pressure sensor. These are usually combined into one sensor. So if you have this type of sensor, they're usually combined into one. Some vehicles don't use a manifold absolute pressure sensor, but use what's called a mass airflow sensor or a MAF sensor. And so there can't be some differences. It's really gonna vary. It's gonna depend on the vehicle, the year, the make, and things like this. To know for sure what's going on with your vehicle, it could be a good idea to get a diagram where all the sensors are located and what's going on. For example, right here, you have a manifold absolute pressure sensor, but then you also have a mass airflow sensor over here. So just be aware there can be some differences. And so what are some possible causes of a P0106 code? Well, the first thing that could cause this is going to be a bad manifold absolute pressure sensor. It might have just gone bad. It just needed to be replaced. Keep in mind, anything wrong with the wiring going to the sensor, open, short, bad connection, anything like this is going to cause the same symptoms as a bad sensor. But the first thing that could cause this is going to be that sensors just failed. Another thing that could cause this is that there's a vacuum leak going on somewhere around the engine. And this would basically mean like a loose or broken hose, a bad intake valve gasket, or something along these lines. Basically, all the air going into the engine should be going through the throttle body, but it somehow it's getting into the engine, it's going around this. There's a loose hose or a bad gasket, and air is getting into the engine around the throttle body. Then this will cause a vacuum leak or an intake air leak, and this will cause issues. And so the next thing to check for would be a vacuum leak. Some other things that might possibly cause this would be something like a dirty air filter. If the air filter gets really dirty, then it might just be blocking the flow of air going into the engine, and that might be causing problems. So be sure to check to see if your air filter is really dirty. And another thing that might also be causing issues is that if the catalytic converter gets all clogged up and the exhaust can't flow out very easily, this can cause a back pressure that can cause problems sometimes. Usually if it is something like this, you're going to get other codes. So if you are getting other codes, be sure to pay attention to that. And so that's basically it. I just wanted to give a basic overview of how you go about fixing a P0106 code. If you have anything to add, please comment down below. If you have any questions, ask and I'll try to answer them. If this video helps you, please click like, please click subscribe and have a good day.